All right, so I have to say a few words about what the symphony orchestra is about to do. They're going to play a huge piece. That's one of my all-time favorites, Dvorak's Ninth Symphony. And Dvorak is a Czech composer, and the story of this um, symphony, it's a New World Symphony, was it, he came to America, and he actually decided that he wasn't going to go to like cool places. He was going to go to a little town called Spillville, Iowa. I don't know if anybody's been there. I have not. I hear there's nothing really there. But he went there, and um, he kind of interacted with Native Americans, and he learned some of the music, folk music there. And um, he decided that he was going to write a piece with a lot of like American kind of themes, and he used Native American ideas. Um, and he's very Czech, so I definitely hear the Czech in there. I definitely hear some of the Native American. He used a lot of what's called pentatonic scales. And um, this piece in particular, the last movement, is really big. It has a really big brass section, and that's kind of why I picked pick the piece, because my, the brass over here said, can you play something awesome in the brass section? I said, sure. And so I gave this to them, and they, I think, I think it's, it lived up to your expectations, yes? Yeah. Okay, good. Um, <laughs> I told them, you know, I, um, I don't know if they still use it, but ESPN uses this all the time for old mon football montages. They, they use the Dvorak Ninth Symphony. Um, and I remember when I first started teaching, I taught uh, general music in Orono, and I showed um, eighth graders this, and they didn't have an orchestra program up there, and uh, I taught them, and uh, a bunch of kids said, yeah, we downloaded Dvorak's Ninth Symphony, we've been listening to it ever since you talked about it, and it's a really wonderful piece that I can get eighth graders excited about it, so I hope you enjoy Dvorak's Ninth Symphony. <laughs> Thank you. 